Hey, what's going on everybody? Hope we're doing great today. Happy Wednesday. We got five matchups on this NHL slate today. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. Definitely helps out the channel. Check out all my betting links in the description below, guys. Really good offer with BetMGM. Link is in the description, guys. Bet5, get 150 in bonus bets. Amazing offer. Go ahead and hop in there. Uh, same good offers with FanDuel and DraftKings. Good way to get back in the action, especially with NBA coming back tomorrow. So you want to have the bankroll built up for that. And uh, yeah, we'll hop in it here. Very light slate today. Just five matchups. Starting with the Buffalo Sabres versus the Montreal Canadiens. Buffalo opening up as road favorites at minus 150. Montreal plus 130 with the over-under at 6.5. Buffalo coming into this matchup 24-27-4. Montreal 22-25-8. Head-to-head. Montreal 2-1 in the last three head-to-head -head meetings. Buffalo coming off an of Anaheim loss. Montreal on a two-game losing streak coming off a Washington loss. Uh, Buffalo is just 2-5 and five against Montreal. Haven't been the best head-to-head. -head. Um, the Unders hit in Buffalo's four of their last six matchups. Um, and not a matchup I'm in love with on this five-game slate here. I think Montreal's a good underdog today. Neither team playing that great right now. And... Um, yeah, I think I'm going to take a shot with Montreal plus one and a half home at home here. Next matchup, we got the Philadelphia Flyers versus the Chicago Blackhawks. Flyers opening up as road favorites at minus 220. Chicago plus 180 with the over under at six. Flyers coming into this matchup 29, 20, and seven. Chicago 15, 38, and three. Head to head Flyers seven and three in the last 10 head to head meetings. Uh, Flyers on a two-game losing streak, coming off a New Jersey loss. Chicago, 1-9 uh, and nine in their last 10, coming off a Carolina loss. Uh, Philly, 7-2 and two against Chicago, so they've been very good head-to-head. -head. Chicago, um, yeah, the Unders hit on 14 of their last 20 games, so maybe the Unders are a good play here. They're 1-4 and four at home. Uh, Flyers, you know, had that two-game losing streak. But it, for me, it's hard to sh trust the Blackhawks here. And uh, obviously with their track record and how bad they've been, I think I got to roll with the Flyers on the road. We'll win a bull game for them in here on this uh, matchup. Next matchup, got a good one here. Two with some of the elite teams. We got the Boston Bruins versus the Edmonton Oilers. Edmonton opening up as home favorites at minus 140. Boston plus 120 with the over-under at 6.5. Bruins coming into this matchup 33, 12, and 11. Edmonton 33, 18, and 1. Head to head, Boston 2 and 1 in the last three head to head meetings. Boston coming off a Dallas win, ending their four game losing streak they were on. Edmonton on a two game winning streak coming off an Arizona win. Uh, Boston 5 and 10 against Edmonton. They have not played well against Edmonton here. The unders hit in eight of their last 11 games. Uh, so a lot of under games for the Bruins. Uh, Edmonton 8-0 at home. 17-3 in their last 20 here. Dominant at home here. We've seen Boston really struggle, I would say, these last two weeks. And uh, barely sneaking by a good Dallas win. Good Dallas team they snuck by. But, uh, yeah, I like Edmonton. Just dominant at home. Bruins haven't been playing well. I think I'm going to lean with the Oilers at home in this one. Next matchup, we got the Columbus Blue Jackets versus the Anaheim Ducks. Anaheim opening up as home favorites at minus 115. Columbus minus 105 with the over-under at 6.5. Columbus coming into this matchup 17, 27, and 10. Anaheim 20, 33, and 2. Head-to-head, -head, Anaheim 9-1 and one in the last 10 head-to-head -head meetings. Uh, they've been very dominant. Columbus just 3-7 and seven in their last 10. It's been a real struggle for them. Anaheim coming off a Buffalo win. Yeah, Columbus 0-5 against Anaheim. They have not been able to beat them here. Um, oh, the bad part is Anaheim's just 4-15 and 15 at home. They really don't get wins at home, which, you know, I don't love. They've been very good head-to-head -head here. 
But um, I don't know. I think Columbus is a good dog on the road here. Anaheim playing poorly at home. I'm going to take a shot with the Blue Jackets plus one and a half here. In the last matchup, we got the Toronto Maple Leafs versus the Arizona Coyotes. Toronto opening up as road favorites at minus two or at minus two hundred. Arizona plus one seventy with the over under at six and a half. Toronto coming into this matchup 30, 16, and 8. Arizona 23, 28, and 4. Head to head. Arizona 7, 2, and 1 in the last 10 head to head meetings. Toronto on a four game winning streak. Coming off a St. Louis win. Arizona, they've lost their last 10 and beyond. They are a horrible stretch for Arizona. Um, yeah, I don't know if I can trust them. The overs hit in both these teams four of their last six. So maybe the overs a good play today. Uh, Toronto, four and two on the road. I simply just can't trust Arizona. Haven't won a game. Haven't won a game this month and leading into net last month as well. Yeah, I think I got to roll with the Maple Leafs on the road in this one. That's going to be it for the video. Good luck with your picks and parlays on Wednesday. Hope you guys all cash out and I'll see you guys Thursday. Have a good one.